Let's bring it up. Oh, oh, oh don't hit the wall. <laughs> oh no, whoa. Check it out. I got the DRC FX651. It's a two channel plane, but it is an Eagle. <laughs> Look how cool that is. So like I said, it's two channel, 2.4 gigahertz, and it's ready to fly. So let's get this out of the box and see what it looks like. What? Look at, that's so cool. It looks like a bald eagle. Not quite to scale of a real bald eagle because bald eagles are massive. This looks pretty neat. So then here is the controller. It's just a power button left and right turn, and then your throttle. And it does take two double A's, because it says so right here in the instruction manual. But this one came with, let's see if there's one in here. No, there isn't. So it came with two 3.7 volt, 150 milliamp hour, single cell LiPo batteries. And then in this pack, you get some spare propellers, you get landing gear, it should come with legs. <laughs> this would be funny with legs on. It should have like legs with wheels on. And then you also get a USB charger. So that's all you get in the box. Now we're ready to take this out for a flight. Now, if I was an Eagle, where would I wanna go? Probably someplace with a lot of trees, a lot of water, and a lot of fish. I know exactly where to go. Let's go. And here it is. We're at the dam. Yes, this is the perfect setting for this eagle because I know coming here all the time that there is some bald eagles that fly around here. So why not fly this bald eagle plane? <laughs> so we're gonna put the battery in just like that, tuck it in there. So let's. Let's turn this on and there's a blue LED flash in. It's looking for the controller. We'll turn the controller on and now we up down the bind. Let's see if this can fly like an eagle. And maybe some of those eagles out there, uh, I don't know where they are. They're probably in their nest right now because it's, it's just about to get dark, but maybe some of those eagles will see me flying around and want to come out and, and fly around with me. That'd be pretty awesome. Let's see if this thing can take off from the ground. Oh, we do have lift off. Oh, and we have fugoids. Oh, there we go. There we go. A little less throttle. <laughs> well, you could definitely tell that the eagle is being affected by the wind just a little bit and it's not it's not a real hard breeze but it does fly so that's that's one good thing let's bring it back down here now i killed all the throttle and i'm just gliding now and i like that there's so much white on it because it does make it easy to see Bring it up. Oh, 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 don't hit the wall. <laughs> oh no, whoa. Oh, oh. <laughs> took it right on the beak. Let's see how good a hand launch is. Oh, I feel the breeze picking up now. Oh man, that's that's unfortunate. The wind is supposed to get a little lower as the, as the sun sets. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to see this. It is getting a little bit dark. I'm gonna brighten it up in the edit. Yeah, let's just chuck this eagle over the side of the dam here. Now this is gyro stabilized. Okay, let's bring it down here. It's, I think the wind is actually taking me higher in the air because I'm, I'm not giving it any throttle at all. And I'm, <laughs> I'm not coming down at all. Oh boy, come on, come on. I'm a little scared to take this out over the water. Oh, I almost did a loop. <laughs> almost. We got one acrobatic eagle out here. I'll take it out over the water. 
The worst that can happen is it'll land in the water, it'll float over to the spillway over there, and then it'll just go down over the spillway, which I don't want to see that happen. It's a little, it's a little shaky, but again, I do have a little bit of a breeze. So I think, you know what? I think maybe we'll have to give this a try on a calm morning. But as of now, you can see that a little bit of wind does affect it. The other eagles that are in their nest somewhere, they're probably watching this one fly around thinking, oh, we didn't train that one how to fly. But it would be pretty cool if, see, I think the wind, I'm almost, I'm barely moving, but the wind's keeping me uh, going higher. It's keeping me, yeah, the wind's going this way because now I'm going that way and I'm like moving pretty good. So it does struggle to go against the wind. There we go. If you're just, if you're just real gentle with the controls, it, it does fly pretty smooth. Let's see if I can land this eagle. Ooh, boy. You can tell when it catches a, a little breeze. It does look really neat though. I gotta give it that. It does look really neat flying around. It looks like a bird just gliding around. Oh, I thought I was gonna hit the building. <laughs> I, I would like to try and bring it back over here, but it's so unstable. I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can land it on the top here. Maybe I can land on top of the building. No. Uh, let's see here. Come on over here. Come on. No throttle now. Now I'm just gliding. Just gliding. Ooh. Some crosswinds there. Whoa! That <laughs> I did not do that. The crosswind just took it. Just like that. Come on. Come on down. Come on. <laughs> I'm talking to it like it's a bird. Oh, <laughs> that, that was not a graceful landing at all. See what I mean? See that light just came on? That's how dark it is here. The lights are going on. So as I said before, this is gyro stabilized because when you tilt it front, tilt it back or side to side, you can hear the motors trying to adjust for whichever way it's going. Watch. So you lean it front, you can hear it. You hear the change in pitch for it. So it's trying to correct itself. So let's do one final hand launch. Now for a proper hand launch, you would give it full throttle and, and then toss it. But I'm so high in the air right now. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna toss it. And th there I gave it throttle. Oh, almost, almost did a loop. Okay, so let's uh, get this thing steadied out now. Really cool, cool design performance eh, like I said maybe maybe on a more calm day but there's barely any wind right now maybe on a calm day this would this would fly a little better come on come on oh 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 yeah <laughs> We are gonna end this video on that eh, not so bad landing. It wasn't too bad. This DRC Eagle, mm, it, it could be better, but it's not bad. I really didn't think it was gonna fly at all, just with like the wing design and stuff. 
and the tail like i really didn't think it was going to fly at all and it, it flew it flew it flew okay unfortunately none of the eagles came out to fly around with this one i'm gonna have to bring this back here on a like a real calm day maybe i'll have to try it one morning i know in the mornings when i come here and run the boats i know in the mornings i see them flying around all the time maybe you'll see a video on that maybe you won't who knows thanks for checking out this two channel bird and hit that subscribe button if you didn't already and i hope to see you when i check out the next ready to run rc